uh, 88% of those who responded in their documents support the central terminal. But uh, we're gonna, you know, we're gonna keep pushing for the restoration of the central terminal. Is it a done deal? Like you can't be appealed or overruled at this point? Well, this is a non-binding recommendation. I will continue to lay the facts out that I think are relevant. And uh, those facts delivered with passion and a sense of, of, uh, of priority, I think, are very, very important. Uh, you know, this process just required a little imagination. This process required uh, a little vision. And this process required a little guts. And those three things were missing from this process. There is never enough money in any given year to do all of the things that we need to do in the city of Buffalo. So uh, would I like more money to invest in a lot of different needs in the city? Yes. Uh, but right now we do have people uh, that use the train. Uh, we are looking to improve multimodal access. Uh, we're looking to uh, make the visitor experience uh, in Buffalo even better. And uh, this decision that we've made today, uh, using $25 million in resources that have been pledged by Governor Cuomo, will enable us to do that. I, I would say that Buffalonians are very grateful for downtown development and waterfront development, but they are muttering in the neighborhoods, what about us? And this was a golden opportunity for the east side in the central terminal uh, and it's a missed opportunity. And what's really disappointing is that I feel, and a lot of people in this town feel, that this was rigged. The fix was in. They made the decision before they even went through this fake process. So at the end of the day, we have taken all that public comment into consideration. Uh, there was also misinformed uh, there was also misinformation that went out there uh, that people were reacting to. Uh, what we had as a committee was all of the accurate information, the engineering research, uh, the cost information, how long it would take to build it, uh, information, the impact that it would have on surrounding communities information, environmental information. So at the end of the day, in making a recommendation to the governor, we had to look at the facts, we had to look at the in, uh, engineering research, and we had to look at sound information to make a recommendation.